lore accurate Virgil stomps Marvel for fifty dollars and some drip. Marvel versus Capcom three by the Russian Badger. I've seen MVC three before, and it's a very interesting game. I thought it'd be funny to host a Marvel tournament for fifty bucks as Mayor Jordan. Nice. Without telling anybody <laughs> that the real prize was actually fifty thousand bucks and some Air Jordans. Y you know what? I respect it. Put your money oh, up, not your funny up. <laughs> <laughs> it accidentally turned into the hypest three hours of gaming I've ever witnessed. He's motivated. <laughs> <laughs> Marvel is already the most exciting fighting game ever made. Maximum! Amazing! Incredible! Featuring some of the most broken characters ever made. Is this the one with Albert Wesker? I can't remember if that was this one or potentially the one after. I know Wesker was a character in one of them because it's obviously Capcom. He's playing Virgil, dude! <laughs> Adding Air Jordans to the mix made things go absolutely nuclear. You stepped on my Jordans too hard, dog. I got world-class training from this Irish guy and this other guy named Gary. I will teach you the ways of Marvel. I got to hit hyper combos that I thought were impossible. Hyper combo kill, baby. There we go. I even got to see Spider-Man beaten to death with a metal pipe. Nice. Stick around and let me tell you the story of how it all unfolded. I am begging you. I am taunting you to hear me out. This is my taunt. Yeah, there's Chris Red. Field. So yeah, Wesker's in this game. Okay, I have to figure out what platforms these are on. I used to have a buddy. Uh, we'll call him E. Call him E for short. Man, he used to play this game back in the day, and it looked really good. I'm not good at fighting games. In fact, I play uh, the Naruto Storm games. That's technically a brawler because it's not like Soul Cal. It's not like Tekken, right? Um, not that it's just a high skill ceiling. I would love to play this. I figure out where it's on. First thing, you're probably wondering how I can just give away 50 grand and a pair of Air Jordans all willy nilly. And I've got two. Because Badger is ballin'. At what cost? Doesn't matter. He is ballin'. Probably do an Opera GX too. <laughs> Words for you Opera GX, the legendary web browser that sponsored this video and made the monster prize pool possible. You already know, Opera GX is the browser that stops Chrome from stealing your RAM. But now they've broken away from other boring web browsers with their brand new. Mods. Download Opera GX using my link and click one button to make your browser look and feel like my browser. You'll get my custom wallpaper, custom theme, colors, and background music. It's just the sound of my microwave heating. Chat. Chat. There it is. There it is. The beans. The beans. For those of you that don't know or are new, there is a long running gag that our mod Kiwi hates beans and says beans don't go in chili. And that is all the context you need. I, uh, you're welcome for the civil war that has now ensued in the uh, comment section. Being up beans, but I find it soothing. I've got custom sound effects too. Anytime you open or close your browser tab, you can hear the sound of a metal pipe falling in my garage. It's so good. If you hate those types <laughs> of sounds, then swap them out with something you like better on the Opera GX store. Really? Yeah, I, I'm sure that if I wanted uh, to open a new tab, I could have ba Badger saying swouse. <laughs> Please make it happen, Badger. Disable them all together. It's 2023, and it's time for you to customize your web browser for maximum comfy. Maximum! Just four clicks will import all your settings from Chrome. Just go gear icon, synchronization, import bookmarks, and bam, you got all your stuff back. Please download... So I've actually... Well, Badge, I, I do like going through these ad reads. I've actually been really contemplating this past week swapping over. Allegedly, Google Chrome has had some sort of update, some sort of potential policy change that a lot... Like, people like uh, Sog, some morning gamers, Mudahar have uh, been looking at and uh, they've been getting a little vocal about. I don't know too much about it. I would definitely do your research on that. But, you know, as someone that uses Chrome for my React content, I've definitely been debating on switching over. Opera GX using my link below to support videos like this. And there you have it. We have a $50,000 prize pool all because you downloaded Opera GX and installed my mod, right? Right? There's no doubt that the money and the J's made the end of this video downright diabolical. That was for Manhattan! That was for the Big Apple! That was for not- <laughs> but the start of this video was rough. I was so unprepared for this, it took me forever just to find a controller. And the one I finally did find was a bootlegged piece of shit with a giant D on. Am I playing on- Oh my god. What is this? Oh, that brings me back to like- Mad Cat's GameCube era controllers. Oh boy. You know the GameCube controllers with the rubber grips on the side? Oh god, this is 
<laughs> Chef's kiss. I love it. Peon. Am I playing on pad or stick? I'm playing on a controller from China that I can barely read. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure I got like the Dormammu 600 right here. It's got a D on it. Oh, you got the, got the boy station, dude. I got the <laughs> Smang Smug. Smang Smug. <laughs> this thing is shaped like a PS2 controller. It's got Xbox buttons, and for the first two hours of gameplay, it felt impossible just to hit the block button. Pop the fat oh, I believe it. Chase. Oh, you're dead. I'm gonna crease your J's, Nemesis. I'm gonna crease your J's. No, no, I'm gonna crease your J's. Your J's are mine. No, fuck, block that. <laughs> no, you fucking idiot. Leave my J's alone. There's no way Banjo goes block that. My brother in Christ, you're controlling the. <laughs> <laughs> He's like a Pokemon like, Doom block! Please! Bro, you <laughs> made the sandwich, Badger. <laughs> Brother, you made the sandwich. Bro. Wait, what? Badger be like, block that. <laughs> it's goof o'clock right now. The Monday I first booted up the game, I was completely overwhelmed. I knew the control, so I thought I was ready. Light attack, medium no. attack, heavy attack, special attack, chain them together to make combos and hit the super hyper cinematic thing with left trigger. How hard can this be? It's a, see, here's the thing. Here's the one fault in that logic badger. It's a fighting game. I, I've seen high level tech in gameplay. I've seen le less higher end because I'm not necessarily in it. I've seen higher level Soul Calibur gameplay. It's why, like, like, these people are truly built different. They are built something. Hyper Combo KO! Turns out, extremely hard. Frozen concrete hard. Nokia phone made out of tungsten hard. Yeah. Every fight is happening way too fast. I don't know how to block. I have no idea what advancing guard is, but the announcer keeps screaming it at me. Advancing guard! <laughs> Chat's telling me to turn off simple controls when I don't know what that means, and the only advice of my buddies is to practice my quarter circles. What the fuck is a quarter circle? Is that like a tilt? So I, you have to understand, I come from Naruto Storm. You know, Naruto Storm 4 specifically being the one I played most recently. Like, because you have tilts, right? Where if you, uh, I'm not going to go into the characters, but yeah, you'll, you'll have to tilt. It's not a full press for, uh, to a side, right? Because that'll just make you move, but it's a tilt. It, yeah, it's, it's, you have to quarter turn without moving. It, it's such a weird, fighting games are truly just built different. Chief, you mind telling me what you're doing in that game? Sir, Sir. quarter circles. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The whole first day was fighting game MFs yelling words at me that I did not understand. Why didn't you fucking tech that, Badger? Dog, where is your neutral air? It's parry, then punish, fuckface. If my plane ever crashes, I'm just going to hit an iframe on the impact. <laughs> just, just it's like jumping before you hit. Bro, just Dark Souls backdash you're good. I am 100% Korean backdashing out of fuel. <laughs> to make things worse, Twitch has a prediction feature that allows chat to vote on who they think will win a fight by wagering fake imaginary made-up channel points at any time. Did I you do love this. I have seen Pokemon channels uh, do this with, with uh, Pokemon battles. It's great. Here I was playing, they bet against us by a 20 to 1 margin. Not only did I suck, but I could see just how much I sucked, according to Twitch chat, in real time. Yeah. I got to feel the pain of being digi for a day, from the nonstop insults of chat to a brain dead skill level in video games, and it is brutal. I don't get ready, demon. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> I, no, no, no. This is Digi, if you get command grab like by the dog one more time, you better hold the floor. Y'all didn't put any points on Digi, did you? I literally not played a fight against that was like We didn't do that to Calvin. We didn't do that to It was almost a million to 50k. <laughs> the dudes betting against Digi just pulled a Brinks truck up to Mandalay Bay and were like, you know what the fuck I'm here for. All of Monday was filled with everybody bullying each other for their character selection, which in some cases was understandable. Super Scroll, Rocket Raccoon, and Amaterasu, what is wrong with you? Do you have a mental illness? And the only thing more spam than the- According to YouTube advertisers, potentially. I, I Badger made that joke. I think it was in the Fortnite video, and I've never, I have never stopped laughing about it. It's great. Insults for the heavy attacks because half of us can't win without button mashing. Like, got something better. Oh wait, you're right. Why How is many logs oh, awful? <laughs> Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> this is the I mean, best form of Marvel vs. Capcom. Anything spammed. Air combos, Dormama, Dormammu. Oh, my God. <laughs> but everything turned around when Heavenly invited his friend Gary, a.k.a. Zizix, who I can only describe as one of the nicest, funniest, coolest dudes I have ever played video games. Legit. Make no mistake, he put all of us in the forever box and nailed it shut, but playing a fighting game with Gary is downright unforgettable. Uh-huh. I'm blocking that, bro. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.
<laughs> Do the input no. better. I'm gonna shoot you in the gut. Come here, bitch. Yeah. You want? Jump him. You're level three. Jump him. Oh, oh, I saw him. <laughs> no. Amazing. Gary has thousands of hours. I have literally, I'm telling you, these people are literally just built different. If you're good at fighting games, you are on just some other level. It is actually insane. Yes, I did see Wesker Midnight. It was great. Person Marvel apparently trained iHeart Justice, who has beaten multiple Evo champions, and this guy is humble. It's like fighting game royalty teaching me how to play Marvel. Gary, are you any good? Shit, I'm all right. I'm I did train a player from Vegas that did beat multiple Evo champs. I'm just saying. Legend. Up, who's the furry that slaps everybody's shit? That's Sonic oh, Fox. I was about to say low tier Fox. I was oh. gonna get that wrong. Oh, 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 oh. Yo, that would be an Evo creation. Low tier Fox. Low tier Fox. Low tier God is a furry. I'm terrified. <laughs> <laughs> Gary was the first person to make me understand what the simple control scheme actually meant. Everybody else was just screaming at me to turn off simple controls and swap to normal without bothering to say how or why. But Gary already, with this explanation, has already shot up like in terms of respect levels. I've never met this man. Love to one day. Like, I've never met this man. And just he sounds like more people, more gaming communities need people like him. Because it's one thing to be like, oh, just chat, we'll turn off simple controls, right? Well, I, I don't know what these are. Clearly, he knows he, he knows the content. He knows what he's talking about. He clearly has the credentials to be like, hey, this is what this does. This is why you need to turn it off, right? It's why if somebody is playing, you know, if I'm playing, God, it's, it's much as I wanna, don't want to mention it, Destiny, right? Somebody keeps doing a mechanic and Ruin of Nightmares wrong. I'm like, look, okay, this is what you're doing wrong. Or Vault of Glass, right? Which I'm sure everyone know, knows what Vault of Glass is, right? And someone's like, man, I don't know why I keep dying to Atheon. Look, you died because you had imminent detain on you. This is how you're going to prevent this. This is how we're going to fix this going forward, okay? It's okay to not know. It's why we're here. And more communities need players like this that are willing to explain that to, one, have credentials, two, know their shit, three, just be generally just super legit. <laughs> Just absolute, just legendary people. But Gary was different. Gary, I'm playing on simple. That's the right way to do it, right? <laughs> Look, okay. I'll I will fucking you. kill you. Simple is the way to go, all right? What? You never, you never drop your combos. You what? get easy dashes. You get easy supers. Just win. It's an easy dump. Just You're win. fucking lying. I'm going to throw a break. I am <laughs> I get it now. Simple controls are like the aim assist of the fighting game world. An easy button, casual, babby skill boost that immediately makes you better without any required effort. So I turned that shit off immediately. Nice. Even if I was going to get my shit stomped in Marvel, I was going to get my shit stomped on normal controls, the way the game was meant to be played. I was so thankful to Gary for explaining a fighting game mechanic without laughing at me and turning the whole thing into a bit, because even asking a question as simple as, how do I change the outfit on my character, had all my other buddies turning the whole thing into a bit like I'm the asshole. Yeah, like, how do you get Black Spider-Man? So when you're hovering over the character... Okay, okay, that is a serious uh... question. That's not a meme. I see Black Spider-Man. I'm asking how you get Black Spider-Man. Miles Morales. I'm not saying Miles Morales. Morales. I'm saying the black and red outfit. No, I mean, that's his skin. Like, that's his, that's his okay, skin. okay. I'm just making sure we're on the same page. I'm not so saying, you you were racist, how do you, bro? Did that just come how do you get black Spider-Man? I mean, it. black and red outfit skin Spider-Man. <laughs> on June 10th, popular YouTuber Russian Badger claims Chat, I will I, acquire if... black Spider-Man. <laughs> Chat, if I... God. Yeah, this, this is going down here real quick. If I need to, I will just say African-American if I need to. I mean black outfit. But I wasn't going to let the Goofies deter my development because the next building block of my Marvel evolution was two words. All right, check this out. I need you to do jump and then A. A? Okay. Yep. Okay. Now jump into him. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. What the? This is neutral. This is neutral. This is tech. Foot die. Foot die. Foot. I gotta make sure I got this. There you go. There you go. Yep. <laughs> All right. Okay, I got so it. There you go. I will teach you the way of Marvel. How did you not know the move I was gonna oh do, God. dog? <laughs> Damn it, I can't hit him. <laughs> the pure bliss of learning foot dive was short lived because apparently, even the strongest move in the Marvel Cinematic Universe has a one button counter. Well, yeah. Stop 
Stop holding your block button, you bitch! What <laughs> <laughs> is cheating holding one direction? I can't believe it. But even that wasn't enough to kill my vibe because Monday was a triumph. All thanks to my buddies and all thanks to Gary. If you let me choose one guy in the entire universe to be my hype man in Marvel vs. Capcom, I'm picking Gary in a heartbeat. The legend. Pops. Fuck him up, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. I, I, it would be Muscle Man, wouldn't it? Oh, God. It's so good. I <laughs> Muscle Man. I put a hit box that can't be. Oh, oh. Do you have, a, you have a cheater box? Oh, my God. I can't believe it. You know who else got cheated? <laughs> <laughs> She's not there, bro. I did everything for her. Tuesday was when I really started cooking with gas because of one word, X Factor. Wait, uh. there's a dash. Is that two words? I always knew that flashing red X was a buff. I just didn't know precisely what it was doing. And I'm sure you're curious too, so let me fill you in. X-Factor is a comeback mechanic that provides a temporary buff to your character. The more teammates you've lost, the stronger this buff gets. If you activate it with your whole team alive, it's a level one X-Factor that's kind of a boost. If you activate it with one character dead, it's a level two X-Factor, which is really strong. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. Come here, man, waves. Oh, Come shit. Come on, oh, baby. That's on me. That's on me. Yes, fuck. <laughs> oh, I cannot believe nice. I did. That it's was the most clutch X Factor I've ever hit. I can mm. barely hit those buttons at the same time. But if you activate it with two characters dead on your last man standing, it's a level three X Factor that is downright tyrannical to play. I really love that as a mechanic, though. It is a... It's a last ditch mechanic. That's actually really cool to have both your character, uh, both your other characters down. So you're down to one, right? And just being able to launch a more powerful version. That that, mm, that opens up avenues for play. play again. We're talking regenerating health, better speed, better damage, and when used correctly, can snatch you a victory from the jaws of defeat. Bing, you just pressing buttons, or you know how to play Loki? I said I was gonna hit the buttons harder, and it was gonna work. And it's fucking working. <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. Get webbed, stupid. Oh. Yeah. Uh huh. Nice. Oh, we're focused now, huh? We're focused now, huh? Yeah, dead silent. <laughs> yeah, dead silent. I know those eyebrows are flexed. Fuck. Why are you shooting? Why are you shooting? Damn. Oh, so Come back. Come back. Let's see. Yeah. No, 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 Focus now. Shut the <laughs> fuck up. Dude will absolutely just got styled on. Legendary. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I love it. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I need to get it out of my system. <laughs> You're stepping on my Jordan <laughs> too hard, dog. Now that I was skilled enough to win some games, I had to figure out the right combination of characters, which kind of goofed with my brain. There are 50 characters in Marvel vs. Capcom 3. To me, that yeah. sounds wrong. That feels wrong. But it's Phoenix Wright. You're going to fucking jail, Brian. Huh? <laughs> Just the authority that Phoenix Wright walks towards. <laughs> 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 so disrespectful. <laughs> Just the pure disrespect. <laughs> <laughs> that man is a gangster. On God, look at him. Spending a day learning about all the Marvel and all the Capcom characters I never knew about was a blast. And before you ask me who my main is, Dormama. All right. Like who the fuck is Shuma Gorath? A bowl of spaghetti made out of heavenly sadness? I'm not gonna take this. I'm, I'm so lost. Excuse me, I have somewhere to be. Excuse me, I have somewhere to be. Shuma Gorath is like that meme. Whoever's praying on my downfall, please stop. You won. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, there were plenty of familiar faces from Deadpool to Taskmaster to Dante to Ghost Rider. You like issue upwards, right? Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, <laughs> Stab your jays. Show them. <laughs> oh my god! That was ruthless! Oh my god, Wesker's fucking dead! Rough. It's game over, baby! That's so much fucking damage! Yes! <laughs> Jackpot! Yeah. 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 I'm gonna win this game, bought a Pixie Ghost Rider. Fuck. Not to mention all the household names that even your mom would know, like Spider Man. Yo, hit him with the infrastructure! Oh, watch out, that's Spider Man. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> <laughs> Maximum. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Spider-Man getting judgment cutted will never not be fun. But on the other hand, why is there a dog here named Amaterasu? Who brought a dog to a fight where half the characters have guns? I mean, it's from Okami, though. I mean, we're talking about Japanese divinity, right? My vertebrae compressed into the ground. What the dog do? I like how everybody's tactic against Calvin is just pick someone with a gun because he has a dog. See that you're picking Amaterasu against Deluxe Wesker. Okay, I see you. When it came to choosing one character over another, the deciding factor was almost always the hyper combo. This is the hyper yes. combo. My favorite is Deadpool's fourth wall crisis where he literally smacks an opponent. Oh, with this is where he grabs his health bar and smacks them, right? I vaguely remember this when my buddy E was playing this. His own health bar, and you would not believe how hard it was for me to learn. I want to get the level three, though. Oh, you got it? There it is. Oh. Hit him. Uh, Hit him once. I dare you. <laughs> Oh, Just fucking murder me. I don't. <laughs> this is my taunt. <laughs> <laughs> I just hit my taunt button and you executed me. How dare you? One, it requires three bars of meter to activate, which when other hypers only require one bar is a huge gamble. Two, it's a counter, which means it can only go off if the opponent hits me. Oh god, it's me, Spider. Oh fuck. <laughs> Why won't you fucking hit me, goddammit? No! I will never see my health bar hit somebody in the face. And three, the input to activate it is a dragon punch, which is basically a zigzag motion on your analog stick that for a shitter like me is hard to do. Oh, that's a lot of input, to be fair. That's a lot of input for a very small window. Yes, I did it! I got you, Mickey! Health bar in your face! Feel the love of the hyper combo! Yes! Oh, my God. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. Oh, God. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Pulling off a level three hyper combo with Deadpool on my second day playing Marvel, I feel like the coolest guy in the universe. Hey, what's oh, up? Absolutely. That's, not an, that's not an easy feat. Fighting games have a high skill ceiling. Badger should absolutely feel like goaded right now. Guys, I just bought a 1911 in a Red Lobster parking <laughs> lot AMA. <laughs> that is until the next day. Heavenly invited the legendary fighting game YouTuber like Thero to play with us, and it was like Michael Jordan walked into our Discord and beat the shit out of us with lawyers. Hey, come on. I, I've vaguely heard of them and that's no disrespect at them i just i i haven't really played the in the fighting game scene i have never really had you know people around me that have wanted to play fighting games or brawlers i, I defaulted to brawlers because of that right i mean it sounds like this truly is a clash of the titans now family, look at my family look at my family look at my family <laughs> Find some evidence in this oh, missile fuck face. Hold this no, no, yeah, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. You know, he me I didn't mean it. I did not mean to touch a death, please, no. A knife. Here, here's another one. Okay, what's the time? Oh! oh. I think it'll work. Oh, no. Why does Phoenix Wright have the face at the end game screen that says you obviously don't own an air fryer? I don't want to see you in court. Being stinky, judge. No. Whopper. Higher one win. Hey man. So. <laughs> he shoved so much valuable information into my brain, it was like my performance exploded. Happy birthdays were the first thing. When your opponent tags in one of their teammates for help, you can punish them both with a well-timed attack that basically lets you double dip on damage. Right. Makes sense. Oh, hey, it'll be yeah. 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 Hey, man. Yeah, baby! My Thero taught me everything, from the youthful stuff like wave dashing and advancing guard, which is basically like saying nuh-uh to all incoming damage. To the charge of wire fraud, you are pleading nuh-uh. Nuh-uh! Nuh -uh. you mean nuh-uh, <laughs> your honor? <laughs> Shut the fuck up. You wasn't even there. Shut you swear to honor. tell the whole truth, nothing but the truth? <laughs> Shit, I guess. <laughs> your honor? Your honor. He even taught me snapbacks, a move where you involuntarily swap your opponent's characters by kicking them off the map. What's the dog doing, bro? Oh, <laughs> you <laughs> So, so Where did Phoenix <laughs> right go? I couldn't always execute Left the combos field. and Gone. didn't always take his advice, but after a day with Lythero, it felt like I was finally playing Marvel vs. Capcom for real. Wait until you find for a pulsar blast, dude. It's over. <laughs> I need you to <laughs> circle back buttons.
Badger, quarter okay. circle. There you go. It's over. It's, it's, it's over. The the best best one. One. We're the best special in the game. I'm not joking. Wild. Watching Badger get better is like watching a Chia pet grow. <laughs> Once I was able to go toe to toe with Mickey, the trickiest Marvel player in the whole Discord, I knew I was ready for the tournament. Oh my God. Overliable. Block. Oh no. no. Oh no. That's devastating. Psych. Rough. <laughs> Jesus. Have you got re Christian? Yeah, just... ah, what are we doing here? What the fuck are we doing here? Danger. Oh, you fuck. I can't believe you've done this to me. Can I just wave dash backwards? No, you fucking rat. I'm so fucking done with this. You have no clue. You have no idea how fucking done I am. No, no, no. No, 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 no. I am so fucking done. It's not even funny. Come on, Mickey. Get off my fucking screen. I was so ready to unload that, and you shot me in the foot. With that 20 minute preamble out of the way, it's finally time to see who's the scrub and who's about to deposit $50,000 into their bank account in a brand new pair of Spider-Man Origin Story Air Jordan Retro 1s. Because, you know, 50k on the line, I'd also be playing out of my fucking mind. <laughs> <laughs> this is a best of five single elimination tournament, and if you want to win the prize, you got to beat the final boss at the top of the mountain. Legend. Me. And before we start, there is a full VOD of all the streams in the entire tournament linked in the description if you want to see every second and not just my highlight reel. With that said, let's fucking do this. In round... I, I really do love that this whole preamble this whole prelude was was there this definitely is adding to the video in just so many great ways number one we've got calvin versus bata and i can't believe it <clears throat> calvin didn't show up oh i think it's important to remember i told all my buddies that this tournament was for 50 bucks and some air jordans right. i didn't tell them it was actually 50 grand <laughs> until game time but with calvin's <laughs> failure to show up he is immediately disqualified making him an embarrassment to the entire discord and tonight's Biggest loser. Oh, 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 the shade. Oh my God. Oh, that's so good. It's all, I mean, to be fair, take that bracket win. Take that, uh, take that W. Ooh. Up next in round two, we've got the ADHD Goblin Digital Vagrant versus the indestructible American hero Grouse. And I've got two words for you. Get his ass, please. Do not let this motherfucker progress. I don't want to see anyone else do this. Someone talk to him about to play like a bitch and I'm mad. I don't want to see him. Put the controller around. No, we are not putting a controller around somebody's neck and twisting it. It's a wireless controller. You can't even do that. Yes, yeah, so basically we're gonna fucking kill you, bro. That's just of no course. Chad says that. I say you can't choke him with a wireless controller. There are no wires. Looks inside. Wires. 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 Oh, hold on. Let, let his chat cook for a second. Let his chat cook. That's crazy. You right. choke someone with the small copper wire in between the circuit. They deserve that. Yeah, 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 that's a win. Damn. Rouse going off. Rouse game. Wow. 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 Yo, man. Oh, my God. Yeah. And Digital yeah. Vagrant getting sliced up like some salami right now. It's not looking good. Oh. For freedom. <laughs> Gross, Rouse. 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 Ooh, ooh, I think this is it. I think this is it. Oh, no, I missed. Went in, even though we didn't have to. It's not over yet. It's not over yet. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it's good. It's getting close. Never give up. Keep fighting. Oh, no. Oh, no. Not like this. 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 Oh, this has got Chad heated. Oh. Chad is heated right now. Oh my god, the chat. Wow. <laughs> the rat. <laughs> Look, if it works, if it works, it ain't stupid. <laughs> But that's the exact moment where Digi's luck ran out because Grouse slapped his shit for two straight rounds and sent his ass home. For some nice. reason, Digi took this literally and thought being eliminated from the tournament meant he had to leave the Discord call, which was <laughs> not a rule and left plenty of us confused. It's like Digi thought he was banished to Arby's just because he lost the tournament. I thought I had to banish be banished to Arby's? Oh, yeah. Me going to Arby's after I lose a $50,000 Marvel vs. Capcom tournament. <laughs> Me walking to the fridge to get my five-day-old Caesar's <laughs> 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 
that's too sad. Oh. Wait, we're going too deep. That's too sad. Don't do that. It's going to be all wilted at that point. The Caesar, especially if you had the Caesar in the salad. Oh, God. Oh, it's good. Oh, I know that taste. I know that feel. I, look, look, chat. I, I had to live poor for a little bit. Sometimes you don't get to the salad for a few days. <laughs> <laughs> Fresh Caesar salad, already not a good start. <laughs> 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 An uneventful clean sweep that was completely overshadowed by me being a little too honest with Gary and Lythero. I don't know what it is, but some of their impressions are so, so good, but some of them are so, so bad, and it just doesn't add up in my brain. Spider-Man going through his canon event right now. I, I created you. Miles. You preached my J's. Spider-Man, why'd you crease that man's J's? <laughs> I, I didn't. Damn, I feel like Lythero's impressions are kind of mid. But that was really good. That was really good. <laughs> Your spot is so good. I think you are spot. Thanks. Thanks so much. I love being a good No, you gotta understand. Gary's Joker is so bad, but his Batman is so good. It makes no sense. It makes no sense. No one's Batman impression is bad. Joker is too old, Joker. Batman is. Oh, wait. wait. <laughs> oh, I can hear it. Oh, oh, I get what he's saying now. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> <laughs> You're in an alley in a trench coat. What the fuck? Gary, is that your joker? This is my joker. Heavenly. You sound like Roger from American Dad. <laughs> <laughs> Why is the sun so loud? Batman. Batman is my joker, Batman. It does sound like Roger. Oh, my God. Oh, the legend. All right, all right. Commentator, get back in the booth with your mid co commentator. Oh, your spot is so good. Motherfucker, call him mid. That's hilarious. Yeah, I was just using my normal day voice. He called me the fucking spot. <laughs> Bottom beats Bing 3 0, Mickey beats Booger 3 0, and we're on to Pasta versus Grouse. They were neck and neck at two games each, entering round five, and that's where the game really started with Captain America as Grouse's only hope. 2 2. It, it defeat much time. It's got to be really careful. close. Yo, man. this is. Oh, he's, man. He's, Oh, this, this is called could get you killed. Oh, yeah, has oh, no. X Factor. I don't bite my nails, but I'm biting my nails. Oh no, <laughs> it's so, it's so good. good. Oh no. <gasps> Up until now, don't even remotely compare to the showdown between Heavenly and her Boku. Oh, These no. two are about as evenly matched as Dante and Virgil. In case you don't play Devil May Cry, Dante is an unemployed subhuman Omega male that is literally too angry to die and literally <laughs> too busy to pay his bills. Royal God. Sounds about right. Virgil, his blue Gatorade arch rival and brother, is a deadbeat dad so obsessed with his own power that he's willing to rip his son's arm off to gain more of it. Show me your motivation. He I took his arm wrong. because he needed more power. <laughs> and an apple. Give me a break. <laughs> Their rivalry is so heated that when they clash, I'm convinced they can form a second son. Your ricks are fake, Virgil. Oh, 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 oh. That's the kind of heat that was radiating from this matchup. It's Heavenly, not... you still got Virgil. This is not over. Oh, this is going to be good. I want Badger to host more of these tournaments in the future. His, his, his casting is great. Oh, he's motivated. That's it. Just swing. Kill oh, that man. Danger. Oh, 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 do it to oh, oh, him. He's motivated, he's motivated, oh, he's motivated. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tempted to say that 49 characters suck in Marvel vs. Capcom because 49 characters are not named Virgil. This yeah. shall be your grave. But even Virgil has his limits, and her Boku is the most technically sound player in our Discord, which Legend. made the third round even tighter than the first two. It ain't oh, over yeah. till it's over. Virgil's worth at least two characters. Virgil's worth four characters. I'm exactly. Not, I'm not joking. Four, four characters. Four characters. Oh, is Virgil really this this uh, this valuable in in uh, in play? Is Virgil really this valuable in terms of a character slot? This is blowing my mind, if so. Oh my god, he's, he's motivated. motivated. Oh my god, he's he motivated. He's getting back all that health, Heavenly. You're getting back all that health. Just don't hit the metal pipes. He's motivated. Wow. Oh, do it to him. Oh, wait, the metal pipe. The metal pipe. Oh. That was great. What? The motivation, oh my God. Yo. That that drop settled. That was such a good move. That was amazing. Oh, Virgil is that good, ladies and gentlemen. I, I do. Oh my.
god. That was amazing. Virgil is broken. What just happened? His moveset looks so good. Virgil made MFs be like, he's not broken. He's more accurate. Fuck you. In case you weren't paying attention, her Boku had three characters alive when Virgil entered the game, and it still wasn't enough. And you know what? That's disgusting, and I actually really love that, though. I mean, if I were to play this game, which I'm really debating on, I'm not going to be good. Don't don't expect anything. I'm not going to be good. I, I would definitely have to pick Midnight Wesker, but I, I mean, if people say he's got, uh, look at the chat. People say he's got some utility. I'm, I'm a Wesker stan. I like that. I mean, but man, Virgil's just built different. <laughs> Skipping any context for round four. You'll just have to experience this for yourself. Goose is spamming. Should have banned the Virgil pick. FR, 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 FR. <laughs> this is when the game starts right here. This is when the game starts. <laughs> he said, damn it. Damn it. Damn it! My, my oh, 50k! Damn. damn it! <laughs> what the heck is the reach? <laughs> Alright, here we go. He's motivated. <laughs> oh my god, you gotta be careful because Hagger oh, can delete your soul! Yeah, no, it's over. Oh, oh, X Factor, X Factor! Oh my god! Oh, 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 wait a minute! Oh, oh, oh. oh he's got the dog up! Oh, oh no! Oh, no! Oh, no. Virgil oh, kind of, kind of like, okay, okay, this is so close. Oh, this is nutty. Wait, what? Oh, what are you, what are you, what no, his, his down oh, diagonal what? is just too good. There's so much value. Oh, no. No way. Oh. Oh, Disgusting. The game does not start There's until no Virgil way. is motivated. Wow. Oh, my God. It's motivated. Oh, my he's, God. He's Virgil fucks. Oh, my Virgil God. Fucks. His down diagonal is just so... There's so much value to it. Like, so in Naruto Storm, specifically Storm 4, they, they uh, buff some of the characters like Zabuza, where you can uh, you can dash, right? So you'll, you'll charge... Uh, so it's charge A... or. For Xbox, right? Y A uh, triangle, whatever. The, I think it's X, the bottom one on P uh, PlayStation is. But you use your charge and then your uh, your move, your, your jump button, right, to dash forward. Certain characters have a block function, so you can guard while doing it. Certain characters will stop their dash mid dash to go straight to a guard. Not every character can do that, and every one of those characters that has been rebounced to have that dash cancel, in my opinion, from what little I do play of Naruto Storm Four, is just absolutely just next level. So how this tributes to this game that I'm looking at, like if you have a die on diagonal like that, it's fast, it's efficient. It's just, it's, it's very easy to flow into that from an upward dodge. It's so nutty. I honestly can't believe that those rounds unfolded like that back to back to back. Semifinals match number two was Heavenly versus Grouse. And I just can't get over how close these matches turned out. One good touch, you can kill Virgil. Helmbreaker! Oh, breaker, that's the move. Just ignore it, move. Oh, that's a oh. catch! <laughs> oh. What? Oh, no! Oh, Man, that was a great, that was a great DP. That was oh a great DP. Oh my god. Grouse, it was the best move. That was the Come best on, Grouse. fucking throw For America. In the game. Oh my yeah. god. He is. Ten seconds on the clock. Ten more seconds. Three minutes. This is a fight. Sliver, sliver. Oh. So close. So close. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. <laughs> Unfortunately, Grouse couldn't keep the upset going and dropped his next two rounds to Aww. Heavenly's Virgil, and the homies were vocally upset about it. He's playing Virgil, dude! <laughs> <laughs> it is grand finals time, baby, with Heavenly in one corner and Mickey in the other. Mickey's Nova is relentless, his Chris Redfield is annoying, and his Ryu won't stop spamming Hadoukens like a fire hose of blue Gatorade. But Heavenly's Chat did mention that Wesker and Chris Redfield are broken their own right, so I feel like I have to pick up this game at some point now. Got the most powerful force in the universe on his side, Virgil. So yeah. this is anybody's game. These rounds were so tight that I swear the last 20 seconds always felt like 20 minutes. Oh yeah. One punch. 100%. Virgil's so squishy. All right, Factor is loose. He needs more power. Oh, he's, gonna get oh, no, he's getting hit. No, he's getting hit. Damn. Right yeah. Oh, it's not for me. So Down. much. Oh, okay. Oh, block this, nerd. Swing, swing for your Jesus life, Mickey. Swing for your life. Wow. Wow. 
I was expecting Heavenly to hit a super, and that was the game over. Absolute oh, upset. Heavenly said it himself that he's losing steam here. I'm losing uh, steam. There's the pressure of $50,000 <laughs> yeah. on the line. There's pressure from Spider-Man Origin Story, Air Jordan Retro 1's yeah. on the line. There's pressure from the thousands watching in Twitch chat, and Mickey has cracked the veil of Virgil's immortality. But you gotta remember that there is a singular force in Marvel that even the red-hot Mickey isn't immune to, and it's called Momentum. Oh. boys! What? No. what? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Heavenly's not going down without a fight. This is a good play. No, it's Street Fighter 1. Oh! Ooh. Oh! Ooh. Ooh. Right oh! Wow! That was an overrode. Heavenly's still got oh, got me. Oh! oh. Oh. No, game starts. Game starts. Oh, the game, game starts. Game starts. Get in, Mickey. Get in. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Unanswered damage. Wow. I love it. Mickey was a metal chair. I don't fucking know. I don't know. Fighting Goku felt right. Fighting Grouse felt wrong. Fighting Mickey. I was like, I can't do it. That was for the big That was for the big apple. That was for nothing. <laughs> I've been working on this video for months, and I still cannot believe Mickey pulled out a victory with a crippled Ryu against a full health X Factored Virgil. That's that is just nutty. too unreal, and I'm not talking Engine 5. But the game. There, there's certain interactions like that that you're just like, this just happened. I, I I can't I can't answer that. I no that, that's a fair game right there. It's like if I went into rapier practice and like they just shoot straight past my guard and just get my helmet or something like that. It's like, like I can't do anything at that. Like sure they called start, but like the moment I attempted to shift, you were already in my face. I, I can't do anything about that. You take the win. It's so good. It's not over yet because if Mickey wants fifty thousand dollars in some of the freshest Air Jordans imaginable, he's gonna have to beat the final boss. Oh I don't want to see you come this far and lose 50 grand, dog. And I still had a trick up my sleeve for the ultimate winner of the final showdown. I have a little surprise on the bracket that is covered in a gray bar at the bottom. It's oh time no. for Mickey to fight the final boss because if he wants brand new J's and 50,000 of my dollars, he's going to have to take them. Uh, Something's wrong. I can feel it. I'm getting oh. real. This <laughs> <laughs> no, task... Uh, Hmm, I'm scratching my uh, my head here. I don't, I don't know what's going on. Mickey, you're just yeah, so man. good. Those Italians, we know them for being scrappy. Wait a minute. Yeah, the Wait a minute. Yeah. Yeah. That first round was absolutely brutal for me. I had uh -huh. not played a single second of Marvel in over three hours with stone cold spectator hands, right. and Mickey was red hot after beating everybody else. You can call that cope, mauled, seethe, cringe, whatever uh -huh. you want, but I felt like an idiot for not doing a warm-up round just to get my blood flowing. On top of that, it felt miserable to have everybody around me rooting on my downfall. It's one thing to have nobody rooting for you, but to have everybody rooting for your opponent and treating you like pure evil was a terrible feeling that I had never felt before. I finally felt what it was like to be the villain of a story, and I did not like it. He turns the webcam to the side, so this is Mickey's family. Badger's gonna kill you with six tons of, like, game or something. Virgil, ooh, Virgil, that's confirmed. We're all here, come to Virgil. Oh, oh fuck, that's oh, just a like, transformation. Oh, oh shit, oh shit. Huh? The Bro, the we fight is over here? We're getting competitive around here. What are you talking about? What is happening? Oh, God. That, that was a competitive no. X factor no. right there. Oh, you're mixed. You can't block this. Oh, oh my God. 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 He blocked it. Yo, Silver, though? Oh, shit. Nutty. Oh, oh, yo, yo, Nova. I like the On the wake up. <laughs> hey, Nova. Wish I could be you. <laughs> Oh, come on, Mickey. 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 <laughs> the Shadow Realm one, right? Oh, but now we got Villain Badger. It's so good. All that momentum he's built up over the last three hours and take it away felt downright sublime. Twitch chat is second guessing themselves. Discord is second guessing themselves. <laughs> oh shit, wait a minute. Mickey just beat everybody and Badger just beat Mickey. To silence a crowd and feel the doubt creeping in when everybody thought I would get dunked 3 nothing was nothing short of intoxicating. But tied up 1-1, it wasn't over yet. Round Nutty. three, baby, here we go. 
I swear, man, I'm just gonna move that gray bar and it's gonna be like, if Mickey doesn't share it with his friends, it's all gone. <laughs> <laughs> it's all turned to dust. <laughs> Reduced to atoms, if you will. <laughs> see the money palette? Oh, Badge has a lot of money. Mickey, where are you right now? This was <laughs> not what you were fighting against a couple of. Mickey! Mickey? Oh, no! Oh, wait, you were deafened. Go back to being deafened. <laughs> oh, let's check. Let's go. We in there. Yes, sir. Press some buttons. Yes, sir. 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 Chris Redfield crawl strats. Oh my god, I love that this is an, I love that this is an interaction this game makes. Because it's always the toes. Virgil is in fact down. Yeah, Chris took down the Virgil. In fact, oh my god, Pro, get your home, Jack. Yeah. Pro, get your home. Get to the get to the foot. Get to the foot. Let's go. Get down. 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 Wait a minute. Oh, good one, Mickey. Oh. All right, Mickey's up 2 1, but it's not over yet. Hey, oh. Okay, I lost 3 1. Mickey is our tournament winner, and he absolutely nice. deserves it. He beat Booger. Good beat job, Mickey. He bought a beat Heavenly, and most importantly, beat me. So it's only fair that my pockets <laughs> become $50,000 light. But remember, I am on my Joker arc, and I had one more surprise in store behind the gray bar on uh -huh. the bracket. Was I going to force the winner to donate? the money to charity was i gonna force them to split the money was i gonna crease the air jordans before <laughs> delivery Aww. what was i up to great yeah, job so mickey I'll great job it. great job i just got one final little surprise for you all right hidden rule beating me in the boss battle means nothing if you win the bracket you win the prize hey. Hey. come on you know me i wasn't gonna keep this money for myself it would have been way too evil for someone to fight their way tooth and nail through the whole three hour bracket lose to me and send them home empty-handed so to make right. sure i couldn't win the money in the end, I added a little mystery rule to the bracket following the first round so nobody could call this. There it is. It's the it's the badger thumbs up meme. I saw it. But since this is a Marvel game with great power comes great responsibility, so I gave him a choice. A, he could keep all 50 grand for himself. Or B, he could take home 42 grand for himself and give every other player in the tournament a thousand bucks each. And to those of us that know Mickey, his decision was not exactly a surprise. 42,000 instantly, yeah. yeah. Ooh, then everybody else that played, what? Calvin, yeah, you know. 42,000 Everyone else could say, like, I totally agree with that. That's so Don't get cool. shit because you didn't show up. A thousand dollars. And Mickey, keep in mind, this is not just forty-two thousand dollars. This is forty-two thousand dollars and a pair of Air Jordans nice. that are a thousand dollars or less. What are you gonna do with your money now? Yeah, you have the floor, Mickey. What do you what do you want to say after winning forty-two thousand dollars and giving eight grand to your friends? I'm gonna buy Popeyes and crack. Uh, yeah, nice. <laughs> That's my boy. Shout out to Gary and Lythero for making this video special. It truly would not have been the same without them. Better yet. No, these two showing up. That was awesome. I, I personally don't have like, you know, a, a foothold in the uh in the fighting game scene, but they, they seem like they're an absolutely just awesome duo. And um i'll have to definitely check out their content these are just this entire video is just that special shout out to all the homies for making these videos what they are batman look i bought air force one batman look i'm wearing batman look my toes i crushed the front batman what are you gonna do no joker you're crushing them batman i threw away the receipt batman i'm not taking them <laughs> thank you to my paid subs on twitter i'll put your dumb ass in a video for three bucks fuck it to read the same copy pasta oh, we've heard a dozen fucking times <laughs> <laughs> and finally, shout out to Twitch chat for making this regular ass live stream into a whole ass event. Hawkeye versus Virgil gives me mad Hamter in the microwave the vibes. Microwave Most vibes. unpredictable <laughs> death in the universe. <laughs> Before I go, thank you for the incredible support over the last three months. Like, it is insane the amount of stuff that you guys have done for me and I just can't get over it. Buying shit with my Fortnite creator code, using code Badger on GamerFart, Twitch subs, Twitter <laughs> subs, all of this. Thank you so much. I put my heart and soul into this video over the last three months and i really hope it was worth it because if it wasn't i'm gonna that would be bad i hope you enjoyed it and i will catch you next time let's fucking go it was so good it was incredibly good badger you and your crew have made an absolutely special experience here you have made an amazing video i hope that this gets over 10 mil now time for me to ask something of chat if you did find this video 
excellent. If you loved watching this video, if you want to support uh, not just me, I would absolutely recommend, please go check out the original Badger video. Badger video. I know that I go in, in a little different circles. Um, there are definitely people that have found the Russian Badger through me, as there are people that have found Maxor through me, as there are people that have found the Fat Electrician through me. You know, I am this, as a React content creator, a little bit of a nexus for, for uh, many different people. If you did like this video, if you did watch this video, please, even if it's just in the background, please go and watch the original Badger video as this was very <laughs> Bader, <laughs> more Bader confirmed. And this is a very special video. And I would love Badger to do more contests like this. Not not for, not for money, right? Just I, I liked the heart and the soul and the thoughts that went into this. And everyone seemed like they had such a great time. And I'm so glad that Badger has just absolutely ballooned up from where I think he's like five mil subs now, right? It's absolutely been insane to see this. So my my favor, if I can ask this of you, chat commenters, please at least go and watch that video once. If not, leave it, leave it on loop for a couple times, right? Um, get that video circulating the algorithm a little more. This won't go up until after the video has already been out for four days. As you know, he had to put a lot of hard work into this and I would feel a little disingenuous if I didn't let it get its time in the algorithm to you know the maximum effect. And even then after that, hopefully enough people see this reaction and can uh, potentially give it a second wave in the algorithm. I would love to see this video over 10 million views. And please, if you haven't, please go check out the Russian Badger. I'm not paid, affiliated, sponsored by, um, you know, but Russian Badger, anything like that. Just someone watching an awesome content creator doing what they love and, you know, wanting to support in what ways I can. So, alas, please do that if you would. I don't usually ask things of you because I don't feel I should. But uh, if you would watch Badger's video, his original, I, I would greatly appreciate that. And, uh, yeah, I will see you in the next time.